after week 17 it's crazy that already we're we're at the second to last week of the season of the regular season and uh and a lot of things have definitely happened a lot of questions have quote unquote been answered and there are still actually questions that are yet to be answered such as most importantly i guess for our franchise is will we be in the playoffs this year do we want to be in the playoffs this year that is a question that is going to be answered within a week i would say or at the latest in a week's time so personally i can say man that um i have been enjoying the season i hope everybody that is a fan also has in some way felt that this year has been a a good year overall um you always want that especially with all the hopes we had going into the season um a lot has changed though in our team and uh just around the league things change week to week big changes some teams go through them and some don't but all the teams do every squad on this in this league faces big roster changes week after week and our team has had maybe the most drastic changes throughout the year but here we are man sitting at nine wins after week 17 not many teams can say that okay um yeah there's the there's competition out there there's much better teams i would say um going into the postseason but um there we are just sitting at nine and seven at the moment and uh after this week's win against the colts in an away game very important win to keep our playoff hopes alive and just to keep our our morale up heading into next year um you know all we can really hope for after this 2019 20 or 2021 22 season sorry is um is just to end on a high note in some way whether that's in week 18 or in week 19 whatever it may be um just being above 500 i would say um on the in the regular season would be is already a win it's a win considering um the fact that we just completely um have have had to carry on and finish this year with a lot of our key elements you know um on the on, not even on the sidelines just like gone from our from our active roster man so importantly is i would say guys like that we should be very appreciative and thankful to still have Derek Carr through all of this i know there's a lot of criticisms that he gets from from the fans online and in person at the games i bet but and i'm in a, in a way guilty of this too but um at the end of the day man like he's our quarterback we need to support him for what he like is all about and I think that we're actually really lucky to have somebody like him as a quarterback because not all of the teams have that in their in their in their in their roster man on the field that this teammate here is about this team you know he just wears the colors like you know he's not here for the money he's here for like just football and standing behind our logos and stuff so he's he's been with us through highs and lows and i think that the raiders in particular man are a very interesting franchise nowadays um and uh all we can hope for going into this the end of this year is to is to in some way finish um in a, in the season in playing respectable decent football 
and uh and uh hope that next year man we could build around car we could build and have a good o-line because that's what we've been missing a lot is an o-line and also um some receivers um although we do have solid um you know play um skill players like renfro like moreau but we've been without waller man even so you know we've been without um some really key um receivers um so we're gonna have to build and stock up on bringing in some more talent there and again the o-line needs to be strengthened um our backs hopefully can stay you know jacobs and Kenyon drake can come back and uh yeah because he's gone for the year two now with an injury um um and yeah and and so yeah we've just hopefully alec ingold can play next year and we can just regroup like that you know with more talent coming from college football and um because yeah the players that we have brought to the to this team have been contributing immensely to our current record at nine and seven um it's just it's just crazy to think that if we still had most of what we started with where we'd be right now um like would we be at nine and seven or would we be at like 10 or 11 wins on the season you know um so yeah I, i'm still optimistic like i said i still think we're having overall a good year we're we're above 500 we're having a good year regardless and uh next year man we need to we need to prioritize also the defense the defense has actually been playing great today they really shut down you know the Colts is running attack and uh which is quite a quite a task but the the defense lived up and just took care of business there also kept Wentz off off the field for most of the game and uh and we also um you know we got our our special teams too needs to be strengthened um really coached well look i don't know what our coaching situation is going to be next year if, if rich Basaccia will will just be named the head coach or if they bring in a, a different coach but but i honestly think rich Basaccia is uh will stand behind the raiders and give give him an off season to put a roster together i think that he has a future and he definitely has some some upside and promise to what he can do so i would like to see him get a chance at uh at coaching the team for like two years give him a two two year contract that's i think the least you can do for uh because he's really made a case for uh for uh you know, guiding this team in, 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 in the best way possible. I think he deserves to stay. Derek Carr, I think, deserves to stay now too. Definitely. Um, just he just needs more support from his, from his linemen and uh, from the receivers backs. Like, and he also, thankfully, has been making better decisions with the ball. When he when he sometimes just has to make a quick throw, you know, just just nothing fancy, just like do that and you know let them do the plays. Um, so yeah, I hope again that uh, you guys um, stick with this team, stick with the Raiders, you know, have your he head held up high because. We're doing good things at the end of the day. We really are still making the turn. And uh, this team is headed in the right direction now. And uh, and all we can do is just like show appreciation and support and, 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 and the results will, will eventually come as well. But yeah, we definitely want to be more of a powerhouse hopefully next year. Um, Hopefully, yeah, that's what we want, you know. Right now, it's sitting at nine wins above 500. We'll finish above 500 this year. 
whether we're in the playoffs or not is not as important to me as finishing above 500 because that just means you had a winning season. So thank you guys so much for your support as well to this channel. Um, again, just like seeing the uh, the the new people coming um, is uh, just motivating to me to do this and um, just continue to like try to make it better each time. So I'll see you guys hopefully soon. Hopefully within a week I can have another video. So. I'll see you guys. Take care.